We're coming out of hyperspace. Everyone up front. There's the fleet. I hope you're right about this. Oh, look on the bright side. They open fire and we'll be breaking the galactic record for going from zero to space dust. Battle stations? Wouldn't even scratch the paint on those cruisers. Point taken. Even if they don't shoot us down, handing us over to the Republic would probably help deflect the flack they've been getting. I doubt the Empire is interested in doing the Republic any favors. I guess, but they're putting up appearances for some reason. Better not take any chances. Hailing, they're transmitting a flight path. We're to dock in Hangar 8. I'm taking us in. Be ready for anything. My presence was requested. I've been ordered to bring you before my lord, Darth Tormund. Submit to search and seizure and come quietly. I don't really care for that plan. Alien filth has no right to question Imperial protocol. You will not be allowed before a Lord of the Sith armed. You will comply, willingly or by force. Anyone still around by the time the Lieutenant here hits the ground, joins him. Seize this scum! Cowards! You'll all be court-martialed! What are you waiting for? I'm not scared of you. Won't get away with this. Quite a pile we stacked up. So, do we make a run for it? I'm sending this ship down in flames. I know better than to argue. Mako, lock out access to this hangar and be ready for further instructions. No sweat. We're all counting on you. I see you've disposed of your escort. Can't say I appreciate Sith hospitality. Start. Destroy what is mine again, and I shall return the favor. <laughs> Gonna remember that. Today, Corellia's leadership swore allegiance to the Sith Empire. Despite total occupation, the people openly rebel. What should have been a bloodless victory has escalated into full-scale war. The Treaty of Coruscant is no more. I want the Supreme Chancellor's head in my hand when I deliver victory to the Dark Council. You will provide it. What makes you think I'm gonna work for you? Refusal would be unwise. If wealth and acclaim are not enough incentive, perhaps revenge will motivate you. You have made an enemy in the Supreme Chancellor's closest advisor. Do what I ask and you will have your opportunity for vengeance. The sooner I get to break that Jedi's face, the better. So long as our enemies remain on Coruscant, they are beyond even your reach. But Jun Seras will not be difficult to draw out. Getting to him will put you within striking distance of the Supreme Chancellor. Corellia is where we will put them down. There are obstacles that must be removed before we can act. You will remove them. I'm afraid I don't deal with obstacles. Some old enemies from the last war have re-emerged. A Republic privateer made famous assisting Hilo Vs break the Mandalorian's blockade. And a Kuwati noblewoman credited with orchestrating numerous successful uprisings on Imperial-occupied worlds. Consider them dealt with. This star chart shows the last destination of your first target. Make it his final. My subordinates will brief you upon arrival. Mako, the situation's taken care of. Unlock the hangar. I'll explain when I get back. Really? Th that's it? Okay, see you soon. Mako, run this data. Alright, just one sec. Okay, I've updated our astrogation computer. This is a pretty obscure system. Namba o wasasuga kumanagaliasu? Thanks, Blizz. I think I've got it. Last I'd heard, Belsavis wasn't even worth colonizing. The Imperials have it designated as a Republic prison world, though. I like a sense of mystery and excitement. That's something I like about you. Even if your taste is a little questionable. <laughs>